No! 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 Warning, this video contains graphic images of two giant spiders that kill by spider fright. Don't ask a Google app whether huntsman spiders are dangerous. Just take it from me that they are. Well, hello there. I'm outside an explosive container. I'm at work. I've got a big stick here because we've just opened up the door here. And we found, well, basically a family of huntsman spiders. Uh, I have to come in here and now get these guys out. Oh, it scared the guys I work with. Oh, near idea. It's up there. I can see one of them. And the other one is just there. So there's one there. It's about halfway down the container. If I walk up this way. Oh my God. There is the other one. Imagine lifting up an explosive magazine and uh, one of those guys there decides to have a jump at you. I don't want that going on. I was thinking of using a stick, um, but I've actually just found a broom. We might try and do the broom method that you've rarely ever seen me do. Well, I'll come and deal with the one which is halfway along the container. Just try and get him or her. They say it's a her because it's a oh, look at her. She knows this is coming. She knows it's coming. I hope she doesn't jump at me or I'll be screaming. Whoa! Come on, little girl. Oh, I like to run these things. Maybe I can just get it around the container. Come on, this way. The problem is that they want to go for dark areas. Uh, she'll probably don't, won't want to go for the door. Oh, come on. I wish I had my vacuum cleaner and my Dyson, I can tell you that now. Because I could have dealt with this real fast. Come on, little girl. Outside, please. It's been a lot of rain and the rain um, brings these guys in. There's a nice view over here. I don't know if it's male or female, all know it's a giant huntsman spider. Come on with the broom again. Let's try and get her. Come on, she go for the door. That's a good sign. There you go. Miss Lovely of eight legs. Actually, she's going over to where the other spider is. Hey, the what's here? I don't know, some sort of mating ritual, if we're really lucky. Oh, both of them are starting to get scared here. Come on, out you go, little girl. Out you go. We don't want to see me get harmed at work. Inside the explosive magazines, these guys just go anywhere they want. Uh, they said this is a nice dry haven for them. Come on, guys, out you go. You guys ain't got licenses to be in here. Come on, onto the broom. Come on, stop playing with me. Obviously, a matched pair, these two. I like being with each other. Get you over somewhere safe. I've got one of my work colleagues taking a video as well. He'll rejoice in this. Come on, out you go, out you go. I'll try and tackle this other one out. Uh, it doesn't really, they're going for a hidey hole. Oh, nice fast run here. Oh, I love being together. I, it's rare I've seen these guys together like this. Come on guys, out of here. I don't want you inside. Back to nature, please. Oh, one's outside. <laughs> one uh, is playing up. Come on, outside you go. Outside you go, I'm trying to hidey hole in there. Come on, out you go. I think that one's out as well. Okay, well, the problem isn't really solved. They've just morphed and moved to the top of the container. <laughs> they're safe, I'll come back in. Spiders are like that. Spiders are smart. Actually, there is, I can see one there. Up in the corner there. I don't think you can see that, I can. That's what I like to do. They like to hide away in corners like that and jump on you when you least expect. Well, I've been told to deal with the spiders because the guys will not work today until these guys are dealt with. There's one right in the door jam there. Come on, under the broom, under the broom, please. Come on. This one is playing darn hard to get, I can tell you. Not back in the container. That's not your zone, under the broom. I don't know if it's male, female or whatever, the audience will tell me. That's it, and you are on the roof now. Whoa! Ah! It's on the ground! Okay, I pulled off a semi-miracle here. The spider's on the stick and coming towards me really fast. And I will get the spider to a safer home. Uh, that is away from my hand. Now that, don't you love it when they do that sort of funny stance? I don't like it when they fang up. When they fang up, that's not me. Let me just get them between my legs. Hold my other hand and get rid of this bugger. I've got one more. I've got one more to deal with. There's some nice spider home over here for this one. 
God, the amount of spiders, it's been chronic this year. They love things like this. That there, that is their natural habitat, okay? That's where they live. That's where they, they'll get into there and they will love it. And one of my work colleagues has bravely grabbed the other one. I'm gonna put it over in the log and they can happily mate and do whatever they do. And uh, be very friendly with, with each other all day and all night long. Oh, it's ran away now. There we go. At harmony with nature. And what these spiders like to do is they like to get into this area here. If that makes any sense. Just noticing the amount of hair that one's got. Quite amazing sort of spider. Huntsman spider in Australia. And that there is their perfect home. Live long, Mrs. Huntsman. These are our little warning signs that we have on the inside of the doors of the magazine. I think I need to add to this. That'd be something like this, isn't it? They look like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and a couple of fangs out the front. And a circle around it. No spiders. Oh my crikey, Charlie. How dangerous is that? Spiders, and two of them in the explosives magazine. I dare say that was a male and female, but the spider experts out there will tell me. And if it was a male and female, you know what they're up to. Spiders have got to come from somewhere, and it's very rare to see two of those spiders in one, at one time. And that's the first time I've seen that. Uh, very impressive sight. I dare say if you suffer arachnophobia, it's double trouble, isn't it? Um, the problem with, let's say, spiders in the workplace, especially in that environment, being an explosives magazine, is let's say if you pick up a magazine, that's what the explosives are stored in, the box that they're stored in, a spider crawls around, gives you spider fright, next thing you may be startled, you may drop the box, bang, the explosives explode, you get blown up, you're, you die. And when the explosives inspector come out to check out why did this container blow up, they're not going to know that there was a spider involved. And that's how those spiders kill, and it's by spider fright. That's how they kill people often in car accidents in Australia. Uh, it was an insurance company ad that ran. It wasn't that long ago, and it showed spider fright. A little boy taking a spider, one of those spiders, to school in a jar. It escaped the jar mysteriously, as they do, and the dad gets a spider on the windscreen and he crashes. That's what it's all about living in Australia. I'd love to tell you what I've been up to. It's totally secret screw. If I told you anything of what I do, the producers would say, ah, give us back that what you're talking about. You're not allowed to talk about it. Ah. That's the world we live in these days. Total and utter control of content. Mind you, on YouTube, you don't see any of that going on, but I dare say I try to respect it. Better leave this video here. Spiders in Explosive Magazine and two of them. Oh my goodness me, what a spider season we've had. As always, thanks for watching and Bye for now. <sighs> Spider season in Australia. Don't you love it? You know, sometimes you think you're doing the right thing by saving something and putting it back into nature. You think, well, it's going to be safe there. Well, a few days after we put the spiders into nature, one of the all-time great spider killers was lurking around. I was able to capture some incredible video of this very efficient killer doing its nasty work. It's a reminder to us all, unless you're at the top of the food chain, there's always something lurking about which wants to eat you, or even worse still, use you as a vessel for its young. Keep an eye out for this killer video coming from my channel.